Howdy y'all. Name's Dave, channel's TXW5CSM. I did not mention when I did the uh, mobile to shack and shack to mobile changes the uh, menu settings that had to be adjusted. So currently I am set for mobile turbo tuner operation. Again, your configuration may differ, so you need to hunt down your data appropriate to your installation. But for a turbo tuner and a West Mountain Radio Rig Blaster plug and play and an ICOM 7000, these are your exact uh, configuration settings if you're going to swap between mobile and the turbo tuner. So seeing as I'm already in mobile operation, I'll run through real quick and show you what the settings are. So the settings for item number 17 in the main menu, let me back out of here and show you how you get there. So to get to your full menu, push your top left button and then go to other. That'll bring up all of your other options under your ICOM 7000 menu. 17 remains the same for both, which is off. These are your up and down arrows and then you use your VFO knob to switch them between on and off. So for 17 for both the mobile turbo tuner and the uh, rig blaster, you're going to run them both off. We'll go down to 18. For the turbo tuner, it has to be off. You go down to item number 48. 48, which is your CI-V baud rate, should be down to 300. For item 49, which is your CI-V address, is 58H. And the last adjustment you have is your CI-V transceive, which should be set to off. Then all you have to do is back out of your menu using your top left hand knob, back it out twice. That's the normal screen that I operate with. So that is exactly, I would now be set to throw it into the mobile and run the turbo tuner. Seeing as I'm going to run base operations, I'll go back in numeric sequence, starting with item number 17, which again for both, item 17 is your turn your uh, tuner auto start, both of them is off. Item number 18 for operation again with the rig blaster. Your push to talk start is set to on. Go down to item number 48 again. Your CIV baud rate should be set to auto, which is all the way up. Your CIV address is 58H. They're, set, they're both set the same for these applications. Don't know if that is something that I did somewhere along the line. Wasn't able to find that very easily. Uh, see, uh, for item number 50, CIV transceive is set to on. So what this does is gives us the ability to operate PSK31 for this application. So I'm going to go to 14070, swing around to the computer screen here. Shrink that down, open up my software. So for PSK31, things are fairly quiet right now. See if we can pull something in here. There we go. KC9WC. There we go. Everything's operating perfectly. There's a nice loud signal. Let's jump over to that one. WA7RTQ. Oh, very good. Everything's operating as designed. Again, that is specific only to uh, my configuration, my application. So, your mileage may vary, and uh, this video is worth exactly what you paid for. <laughs> Knowledge is only power when it's shared. 